isn't gonna work. Oh, it is working. We are recording. We are playing Starfield. Same game we were playing in the last episode. The same game we're gonna be playing in the next episode. And probably many points. other episodes. Hey, I'm trying to talk here. So we're in Hope Town. And after much, you know, fuss, I talked to this guy. He's the one who has the grab drive. And it was actually a relatively easy conversation to haggle him down to $25,000. So we can finally square away that one quest with the, uh, you know, the people on that big ship where we last left off. It's actually been quite a bit of time since I la last... Uh, what am I trying to say here? Last played this game? No, I've been playing this game all day. I just haven't filmed it or streamed it or anything because, well, this is going to be a long game. We're not going to film everything that happens. It was actually kind of nice to play a game with, without headphones on for a little while. Kind of nice. Just take my pace. Grind up. Money. XP. Still fighting with speech checks and persuasion. RNG. No rhyme or reason even though I'm leveled up on it. I think I'm even further leveled. Let me check here. Skills. Where is it? Social. Yeah, I got two more before I can rank up again. Uh, there was this one time I was going in circles, just reloading, 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 reloading. I was determined to get the speech checks. But it's just like, you'd think since I'm level one, I'd be able to pass all level one speech checks. No, no, no rhyme or reason. Still don't understand how the system works. But what I'm doing next is actually while I'm here, Someone's after this, um, this other captain, this woman I met out by the dock. There's a bounty on her just because she was accidentally moving some contraband cargo. She didn't realize it was contraband cargo. I'm supposed to pose as her and, and see if I could deal with the hunter guy. So I'm going to go try to sort that out. Is it going to be another speech check? How to keep an eye on your oh, valuables. There's the door. If you can't protect your own, you don't belong here. Ron hopes the best. Uh, it's her here. She wants me to get this guy off off her back. Okay. Hello. Apparently he's in over here. I'm gonna have to quick save here. Pit stop. Apparently people don't know. I can know what she looks smell like. Smell the corruption in the air. Oh yeah, I'm sure. So we're gonna do one of these because I imagine I'm gonna be doing this over and over again if it's a speech check. This guy looks friendly. This guy, I could take this guy. I'm new in town. You look like you just got here too, right? Oh yeah. What's your name, stranger? Might buy you a drink. <laughs> Friends call me Ernesto. Just get Actually, right to the point. Because it's my name and all. I'm just gonna make a little this, small talk. A of that. You're, here like to, to keep busy. You're, you're here to kill. Fahim, huh? Came in on that ship, the markup. I bet you didn't know it. Here I'm we go. Tracker, and I'm here for your bounty. Two ways this can go. You know the truth. Either I can talk you out of it or I could kill you. That's the two ways. Wouldn't it just be nice to just like be able to actually say that? Okay, what are we gonna <laughs> You got me. I'm yeah. very surprised. They never see me coming. Just gonna like pat his ego there. Uh, something don't sit right with me. Not sure what. The fact that I could take you. Oh, wait. Maybe. Here we go. Maybe not. Here we go. So, should I go, like, right for the jugular here? Ah! Oh, Jesus. That only works if I think you're innocent. Oh, boy. Ugh. Bounty is awfully large for oh. what they're saying. All right.
fine. I'm not taking you in. That's a funny thing that, that happens sometimes that I else. notice. You can get a crit on, Whatever on you speech. Were shipping, you got to return it. The next tracker probably won't be as upstanding as I am. Oh, I'm fiddling with my microphone. I probably shouldn't be. Whatever you say, Fahim. Fahim. You almost sound believable. Oh, boy. One more drink <clears throat> and it's lift off. Oh, excuse me. Payday is always a good Clearing day. my throat and the frickin' microphone. We're gonna have to go and see how this how this party wraps up. It's like not very action. I get a kick out of speech checks. I wanna fight more. I need. I, I wanna so. go after bounties. But here's the thing. And this is what's ticking me off. Another oversight in this game is there's no warning of the recommended skill level you need. So I'm like, what, level 10 now? Level, what level am I? Where, where am I? Skills? No. Where? Where's my... Ah, ha, 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 ha. Uh, status. Character. Uh, level, level 11. I'm level 11. So I took on a bounty. It was about 3,000. Well, that's good. Everybody in this place, and there was quite a few of them, were level 15. The boss guy I had to get was level 20. It was a hell of a fight. I got as far as I could, ran out of head packs, health packs, had to run away. Well, not run away. They don't really chase you, it's, it's weird. I had to leave, restock, come back. At the end of the day, I think I'm, well, I probably spent four to six thousand dollars just on ammunition. Ammunition is not cheap in this game. It's disappointing. I spent a lot on ammo. I spent a lot on health packs. I had twenty-four thousand dollars going into it. I had maybe eleven when I was done. It was kind of stupid. And they don't tell you before you take the mission. They're not like, oh, by the way, this is level fifteen, level twenty. You know what I mean? It's just like, okay, like. I think the game needs a little bit more transparency in that sense. Because once you accept these missions, you go into these situations like, oh boy. And of course, every now and then when you zoom into a planet, even if... I got bombarded by a bunch of level 20 ships, level 20 pirate ships. I couldn't do anything about it. I kept getting destroyed. And it's weird because the game glitches sometimes and I was following the map to my objective and it put me to the wrong place. I, I escaped, and when I came back, they weren't there. I don't think I... I think I accidentally went to the wrong place at first. It's just... Oh, and there was this one planet, something something three. I just had to drop off some solar cells. Couldn't get, couldn't get a landing icon. It's a known problem. I googled it. So there are definitely glitches in this game. Just they're not the kind of silly ones that you had before with stuff clipping into stuff, you know? So, anyway. Why did I ever take this job? Why? Oh. I feel like I can finally breathe again. Well, someone else is going to come Thank after you, though. You. You're right. I'll see what I can Commerce. do. Commerce. You're is that a, a skill that I have? lifesaver. Take this. Oh, 2,500. That seems to be the average reward. It's not bad. Now, does this place have a bar? And does that bar... We Rangers. Factory. Apparently, my, my person here was a uh, ex-ranger. Best oh. defense. Is this a weapon shop? Yeah. There's definitely a lot of shops... A lot of places to explore. This place is definitely for commerce or another board way towards. bigger than any Hi. of these other games so far. Like, yeah, I've been to Neon a couple times, barely scratched the surface. Just keep it barely. We'll get along fine. Barely, barely. And I'm talking bear with a capital, like, crapping in the woods bear. I don't want like, to be here any longer than we have to. I just want to find... Sales? Wait. Hope Town. 
Yeah, I guess I see the problem here. This place does look posh. Is there a bar around here in which I can um, find a, a, a gig? Because that's the thing. You know, you always want to try to find a delivery gig. Workers like to play hard here. I don't know if I'm going to find... Oh, what's this? Home tech. Oh, is that one? N no, that's a water machine. I'm trying to look for like a mission thing, but I guess I'm not going to find it. I guess we'll just go and um, turn in that quest, get that grab drive installed. Right, here we are. Dock it. Dock it. Here we are. I wonder what they're going to have to say about this whole situation. Would you stop fiddling with your microphone while you're addressing the public, but I'm talking to myself, yeah. Bored. Which is how this game gets sometimes, not going to lie. It's so fascinating and addictive, but it's just... It's a slow pace. You got that beginning of a Bethesda grind. The Constant is a peaceful ship. Command Bay. Well, I have no intention of making it unpeaceful, bud. I wonder how many, like, side missions there are here that I could be like doing. Like, showing up at Nellis and having a now that we know it's help a there. guy get his crush over. <laughs> Just because our equipment's Where's old, the captain? Doesn't mean it won't work are they sleeping again? We've got strict rules around here. No. They're strict for a reason. Oh, wait. It's back over there. I'm not following. I'm not following we the, the quest markers. There's Careful somewhere else. That right fancy wrong. Gun around. You don't need to I have a fancy gun. I thought it was a pretty basic entry level gun. Just stay out of trouble. Okay. I'm trying to negotiate my way through the halls of this ship. They're in engineering. Keeping oh. a 200 year old ship running is no easy task. I've lived my entire life in the constant. Oh, we're not talking to them. <laughs> I was hoping to talk to our visitor from outer space, and here you are. Are you stoked, welcome, bud? Welcome. Are you freaking stoked? I have a million burning questions, but I won't overwhelm you. There will be plenty of time for that later. Please, indulge me just a couple. How did you do it? Did humanity finally discover faster than light travel and eclipse our poor old ship? Oh, I know a thing about astrodynamics. Oh, wow. Oh, I've heard of this technology, but always believed it was theoretical in Rav nature. Drive. Maybe we can talk about it in more detail later. I'm sure you have more pressing matters to handle. I've waited this long. What's a little longer, eh? Yeah, it took oh, me a while to get I've here. Got so many questions, but I'm being rude. I haven't even given you my name. Chief Engineer Kazemi. Well, I kind of knew call that. Me they tell and me. I might add, I'm one of the, the reasons guides. we're still floating out here today. Good work, bud. Uh, maybe you should stop about... No, I get it. You want to know about what's changed since your ship departed. Okay. Yes, of course. Anything Here for we my go. new friend. <laughs> oh, we're friends? Ah, uh, with a ship this old, you have a good heroic engineering stories? Well, it looks like we could be here talking to this guy while... I, I'm not going to film at all. You know, I guess if you're curious, I guess we'll see what happens. Okay, I, I had some conversations with him because I wanted to. So now... What grab drive? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know what? He actually had me for a second. The Paradiso engineers <clears throat> filled me in. Okay, let's see what we need to do. Hmm. hmm. All right. This will be fun, and hopefully there will be no explosions. No more in the explosions. Oh, I have just received word that the drive is here, ready to get to work. <laughs> oh, <laughs> don't worry about that. Engineering Just a humor. Engineering humor. Yeah, okay. We've kept this ship going with minimal incidents this long. I'm not about to let anything happen. But to be clear, what we're doing is very dangerous. And we should be prepared for anything. You need my help? Yes, of course I need your help. 
My team needs to stay on top of their daily maintenance. And I okay. need your help is going to be vital to this procedure. And Okay, you need me to flick some switches. Great, great, great. There are three preparations I need you to help me make while I set things up on my end. Yeah. First thing I need you to do is reroute the power from the port turbo pump to the auxiliary cryogenic radiator. Okay. Then turn the plasma runoff inhibitor function to 5%. Last, you'll need to decouple the magnetic oh. flange pipe enclosures from the auxiliary module assembly. Got it? Let's hop to it. Is this where I could accidentally blow up their ship? I'm pretty sure you're going to give us quest markers. <laughs> These are exciting times, aren't they? Engineering computer alpha. Wow. Hi. Engineering computer. Does it matter what computer I go to? Plasma gun actuator. Okay, I feel like that's the last thing I need to do. Alpha, beta. Alpha, beta. Gamma. Okay, I need to read this again. Because it sounds like I have to do stuff in specific order. And they're, like, kind of directing me where to go. But not telling me exactly what order. I gotta, like, pay attention. Yeah, it looks like alpha, beta, gamma is pretty self-explanatory. So, alpha. I need on this computer. Re... Oh. Uh... Okay. Ah. Uh, so you're going to make me exit the computer, divert power from. So we got we got to go back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. Dispose of the boots. Yeah, I've done that already. Can we skip to pay attention here? Port turbo pump to aux cryo rad. From port turbo pump to aux cryo rad. From port turbo pump to aux cryo rad. From port turbo pump. From port turbo pump to aux cryo cryo rad. It says aux cryo rad. Oh, there it is. They're trolling me here. Did I do that successfully? I guess. So we need to go to this one now. And we need to do what? What? Ugh. Why do you keep going up there? Turn the plasma runoff inhibitor to 5%. Plasma runoff inhibitor to 5%. Plasma runoff inhibitor. Plasma runoff inhibitor to 5%. Then finally we have to go over here and you know uh, do all this rigmarole. Decouple the magnetic flange pipe from the auxiliary module assembly. Magnetic decouple magnetic flange pipe Auxiliary module assembly. Magnetic flange pipe enclosures. Decouple. From. Uh, I forget already. Forget already. Okay. Okay. From auxiliary module assembly. Looks so that like should be it. Is good to go on both your end and mine. Uh, can you go inform the captain while they're finishing the installation? Yeah, I'll Thanks. do that. You know, this place is a little bit of a maze, but at least I can find my way to the command bay now. Now that you're here, I can finally give my crew a chance at a new life. No matter the outcome, I won't let my crew down. Well, well. It would appear we have the means to go nearly anywhere now. Yeah. Thanks to you. Which is the what engineers I was... even upgraded our communications <clears throat> equipment so we can speak with passing ships. 
Turns out it was a pretty easy fix. Probably. Thank you again for all you've done. Uh, sure, let's talk about payment now. Oh, am I that kind of dick? Without you, we'd most likely be stuck. But you went above and beyond. Mm -hmm. I'll make sure people tell tales of your generosity for as long as our society lives. I don't know if we can ever fully repay you. Thank you again. Oh, yeah, they, okay, you, you win some weapons. A 45 caliber ACP and an Now that we know there are other people out there, we need to be more prepared for trouble than- Where did she go? She just like disappeared over here. She's here looking at pictures of all the old captains. I guess one of these is her dad. My crew may not realize it now, but we will be much happier with a home of our own. Yeah, you know what? Why do you need? That's a good question. But I firmly believe that establishing our own home is what our ancestors hey, would want for I'm us. I'm over here. I think that we there will we simulate go. to some degree, particularly when it comes to trade and exchange of ideas. Okay, yeah, definitely. However, we fared by you ourselves for so long. It would be unreasonable for our people to give up our own sovereignty in favor of a completely different society's rules and expectations. It may seem like it's about me maintaining control, but it's more about avoiding massive culture shock. We'll get there, but we'll need to ease into it so future generations can reap the benefits. Side-eyeing me. Kind of cute. So now what? Where will Goodness, we go? I'm not sure yet. We'll need to study our new star map. Then, well, I suppose we'll venture forth and try to find the perfect new home for us. It may take some time, but... I'm confident we'll find something. And when we do, we'll find a shuttle to take us planet side. Thanks again for your help. Well, I guess that's it. We're done with You're these people. You're under orders not to escort you right off this ship. What the fuck is your problem? I just did you guys like the biggest freaking solid in the history of mankind. Or at least in the history of this game. Be thus far, the the, the four, yeah, thus far, I'll take it. Thus far, like you guys are gonna be able to go and do whatever. You're not gonna have to put up with anyone's bullcrap. Now, mind you, I feel like that guy on the surface owes me a thing or two now. Oh great, I'm lost again already. It's not gonna be the mess hall, but. So what do we got here? They gave me a bunch of crap. Oh, wow. Look at this. There are all these old keepsakes that are worth thousands. And there's two and three. Wow, this is a huge haul. It's going to take me forever to flip this crap. Can you imagine? Grab drive retrofit manual suppressed XM. Oh, wow. Look at that thing. Am I gonna be able to find ammo for that? 2133. Excellent. Let's look, let's look like a 1911. But it's suppressed. Damage 44. $18,000 that thing's worth. I only got 22 rams for it. I wanna do some more stealth and sneaky bits, but I feel like I'm gonna to have to level it up. But then you have to level it up by doing it, right? Maybe some of those bounties. Hmm. Maybe I should give a suppressed because I think I think my adoring fan can sneak. Maybe if I give him the spare suppressed weapon I have, then he can like help me sneak around. If you look behind my head, ten thousand dollars. I just need like eighty thousand more and I can buy myself a big cargo ship. That's what I want. I want to buy a big, massive cargo ship that can hold all sorts of crew and haul lots of cargo. I want to take on big hauls. Big hauls. In the meantime, I'm going to have to peruse around, see what else I can do, see what else I can get into.